Welcome to Wildlife X. In this video we are going to talk about top 10 unique animals you won't believe exists. So before starting this video like this video, and subscribe to Wildlife X for future updates. Nature is full of unexpected twists and turns. When you think you've seen everything, a strange new creature appears, immediately restoring your confidence in the unlikely. Mangalitsa pig, aka a pig in sheep's clothing. In the mid-19th century, a woolly pig was found. It's a shame it didn't become as common as dogs or cats as a pet. The Mangalitsa, also known as the Mangalitsa or Mangalitsa, is a Hungarian domestic pig breed. It was created in the mid-19th century by crossing Nagashalanta and Bacony Hungarian breeds with European wild boar and Serbian Umadija breeds. The hair on the Mangalitsa pig is thick and curly. The extinct Lincolnshire curly coat pig of England is the only other pig breed with a long coat. Since the Mangalitsa produces insufficient lean meat, it has been steadily phased out in favor of modern domestic breeds. It is normally fed a combination of wild pasture and farm-grown potatoes and pumpkins. This pig's main commodity is bacon, which is normally packed in the pig's duodenum. Salt, pepper, sweet paprika, and other spices are used to season the minced meat. It's then cut into slices and served with pickled vegetables. As a side dish, the pork is braised with sauerkraut, potatoes, and stuffed peppers. Smoked hams are also produced by farmers. Fresh meat tastes solid and juicy, and suckling pigs are favored for their high-quality fresh meat. Rhinophathicus, or golden snub-nosed monkey. The Myanmar snub-nosed monkey, also known as the black snub-nosed monkey, Rhinophathicus strikeri, is a critically endangered colubine monkey that was found in northern Burma in 2010. Myanmar. It was officially classified as a new primate species in 2011 based on its hair, beard, and tail. In 2011 and 2015, two classes of the species were discovered in China. The species is called Mei Nwoah by Lisu people and Myuk Na Top T by Law War people, all of which mean monkey with an upturned face. The short upturned nasal flesh around its nostrils is said to cause it to sneeze in the rain. When it rains, it sits with its head pointed downwards, covering its face between its legs, according to locals. Emperor Tamarin. The Emperor Tamarin, Saginus Imperator, is a tamarin species, that is said to be named after German Emperor Wilhelm II. It can be found in the southwest Amazon Basin, East Peru, North Bolivia, and the states of Acre and Amazonas in western Brazil. The Emperor Tamarin's fur is mostly grey in color, with yellowish speckles on the chest. The tail is orange, and the hands and feet are purple. It has a long, white beard that reaches beyond the shoulders on both sides. The animal grows to a length of 23 to 26 centimeters, 9 to 10 in, with a tail length of 35 to 41.5 centimeters, 13.8 to 16.3 in. It is approximately 500 grams in weight, 18 ounces. Patagonian Mara. The Patagonian Mara, Dolichotis patagonum, is a large rodent belonging to the Dolichotis mara genus. It's also known as the Dillaby, Patagonian cavy, or Patagonian hare. This herbivorous, rabbit-like species can be found in Argentina's open and semi-open ecosystems, including most of Patagonia. It is monogamous, but it sometimes breeds in warrens with several pairs. The Patagonian Mara has a jackrabbit-like appearance. Number 4, it is distinguished by its long ears and limbs. It has a longer radius than humerus, and its hind limbs are longer and more muscular than its forelimbs. The feet are compressed, resembling hoofs. The forefoot has four digits, while the hindfoot only has three. It has a short, sad, hairless tail. It has grey dorsal fur and a white rump patch separated from the dorsal fur by a black area. The Mara also has a white underside with a slightly orange flank and chin. The average Patagonian Mara measures 69 to 75 centimeters, 27 to 30 in, in length from head to tail, with a tail length of 4 to 5 centimeters, 1.6 to 2.0 in. It is 8 to 16 kilograms, 18 to 35 pounds, in weight. The anal glands of the Mara are located between the anus and the base of the tail rather than being anterior to the anus, as they are in most other cavids such as guinea pigs and capybaras. Fluffy cow. It has long horns and a long shaggy hair, and it originated in Scotland's Highlands and Outer Hebrides Islands. 
It is a hardy breed that has been bred to withstand the region's harsh climate. The first herd book was published in 1885, and two types were registered as a single breed, a smaller island type, usually black, and a larger mainland type, usually dun. It is mainly raised for beef and has been exported to a number of countries. Markor goat. The markor is Pakistan's national animal, also known as the screwhorn or screwhorned goat, and is called Mr. Kaur in Pashto and Mr. Kaur in Urdu, both from classical Persian. Locals say ma means dead and kaur means eat, since this goat is said to eat carrion and dead animals, including snakes and wolves killed in self-defense. Markor have a shoulder height of 65 to 115 centimeters, 26 to 45 in, a length of 132 to 186 centimeters, 52 to 73 in, and a weight of 32 to 110 kilograms, 71 to 243 pounds. They have the highest maximum shoulder height among capra species, but the Siberian ibex outweighs them in length and weight. The coat is grizzled and ranges in color from light brown to black. It is smooth and short in the summer and grows longer and thicker in the winter. The lower legs have black and white fur. Male markor have longer hair on their chins, throats, chests, and shanks than females. Females have a redder complexion, shorter hair, a short black beard, and no mane. Both sexes have corkscrew-like horns, that are tightly curved at the head and extend upwards toward the tips. Males' horns can grow up to 160 centimeters, 63 in, in length, while females' horns can grow up to 25 centimeters, 10 in. The males have a pungent odor that is stronger than that of domestic goats. Raccoon dog. Are you torn between getting a dog or a raccoon? We've got exactly what you're looking for. A canid native to East Asia, the raccoon dog is also known as the mangot, it's a Venki name, Tanuki, or Neoguri. Nycteroites is the only extant species in the genus. True foxes, not American raccoons, are its closest relatives, despite its name. Only the North American gray fox, to which it is not closely related, shares the raccoon dog's habit of climbing trees on a regular basis among the Canidae. The masked face of the raccoon dog resembles that of the common raccoon, Procyon lota, a Procyonid to which it is not closely related. It is known as the Tanuki in Japan and has a long folklore history. It has been classified as a potentially dangerous invasive species in Sweden, where it is, known as MRD Hund, Martin Dog, and Denmark, where it is known as MR Hund, same meaning. Blue-footed booby. Their turquoise legs are still a focal point. These birds, by the way, have very funny mating rituals. The blue-footed booby, Sula neboe, is a marine bird found in the eastern Pacific Ocean's subtropical and tropical regions. It belongs to the genus Sula, which includes six species of boobies. It is easily identified by its bright blue feet, which are a sexually selected feature. In an elaborate mating ritual males raise their feet up and down while strutting in front of the female. The female is slightly larger than the male, reaching up to 90 centimeters, 35 in, in length and 1.5 meters in wingspan, 5 feet. Malayan Kolugo. These eyes must see a lot, and something is likely to surprise them. The Sunda flying lemur, Galeopteris variegatus, or Sunda colugo is a genus of colugo, that is also known as the Malayan flying lemur or Malayan colugo. It was previously believed to be one of only two flying lemur species, the other being the Philippine flying lemur, which is only present in the Philippines. This species can be found in Indonesia, Thailand, Malaysia, southern Vietnam, southern Burma, and Singapore, among other places in Southeast Asia. The Sunda flying lemur is neither a lemur nor a bird. Instead, it glides across the forest. It is a strictly arboreal creature that is active at night, and feeds on soft plant parts including young leaves, shoots, flowers, and fruits. A single offspring is born on the mother's abdomen, after a 60-day gestation period, held in place by a large skin membrane. It is a species that is reliant on forests. Sunder flying lemurs have a head-to-body length of 33 to 42 centimeters, 13 to 17 in. It weighs 0.9 to 1.3 kilograms and has a tail length of 18 to 27 centimeters, 7.1 to 10.6 in, 2.0 to 2.9 pounds. Venezuelan Poodle Moth. 
the Venezuelan poodle moth was photographed in the Gran Sabana region of Venezuela by Kierga zoologist Dr. Arthur Anker in 2009. It could be a member of the Artes genus, according to Anker and another scientist. 3. The moth is often misidentified online as Bombiex mori, 4. And one of Shuka's colleagues hypothesized that the Venezuelan poodle moth bears a slight resemblance to Diaphora mendica. The specific Lepidoptera is around 1 in 2.5 cm long, according to measurements taken from Dr. Anker's photographs. Due to its physical appearance and lack of real details, it has been referred to as a hoax on the internet. Following that, subsequent expeditions to the area failed to find the moth. What do you think about this video? Which of the following top 10 unique animals you won't believe exists you find most interesting? Do let us know down in the comment section below. If you enjoyed this video and want to hear from us again, be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go.